Why hello there everybody. So my name is Lottie and welcome to my channel or if you've been here before welcome back. Um y'all if you haven't noticed I really haven't put out a fitness video update in a couple months and that's because I have been struggling. <laughs> I've been trying my best y'all but I this quarantine is not it's not doing me justice or I'm not doing justice to myself during this quarantine. But instead of avoiding it for much longer, I decided to just put out this video, let it out there, let y'all really know what's going on, let y'all really see these numbers. A weight loss journey isn't linear. It's not gonna be perfect. You're not gonna do everything right all the time. And I'm learning for sure that I'm not doing everything right all the time. And for that reason, things are going like this for me. And instead of shying away from it and keeping that in the shadows, I'm deciding to put that out, let y'all see. So you know that even when I reach my goals, which I will reach, there were bumps in the road. There are definitely humongous bumps in the road, as anybody will go through with any journey. You know, I've rambled enough. Let's just get into it. It is April 15th. You should already know the drill by now. Y'all see that ish? Clearly I got some work to do. Yeah, but I just have work to do. It is April 20th and uh, time for another weigh-in. Y'all see that? According to this, I've gained a pound in a week. But I honestly think it's because of bloating and water weight. So I feel like my results are going to be different next week. Um, Right now, the goal is really just to get back to where I was March 1st, which was 168. I'm 10 pounds heavier, officially. Um, just going to keep working. Can't really say much. I'm... I mean, I'm kind of bummed by it because I've been trying these past couple days, but I'm not super bummed because, mm -hmm. I don't know. I'll get it together. Yeah. See y'all next week. It is May 1st, so you already know that it's time for measurements, weigh-in, body. I actually have no idea where my measuring tape is, so I'm probably going to skip that this month. Let's just get into the body. Gut review. Weigh in. Okay. So I'm a ways away from where I need to be, but hey, at least I lost a little weight this month. A little. April wasn't my strongest month. Okay, these past three months haven't been my best, but all I can do is try better. Try and better myself, so yeah. All right. Y'all already know what time it is. Another week, another weigh-in. It's May the 4th, by the way. So I'm starting to see an upwards trend again. This past week, I've gained a pound. Y'all, this is kind of getting annoying. It's like, I mean, yeah, I'm working out, but I want to blame quarantine, but I know it's my own fault. It's because I'm not eating right or anything like that, but I can't really dwell on the past. So even though I'm looking at these numbers, and they're disappointing. I can only use them as motivation to do better. So I guess that's what I'm going to do. I'm just frustrated, like, I'm just frustrated, that's all, that's all. With myself, not with the scale, not with my workouts, it's just because I haven't been eating that well at all. I'm gonna fix that starting today, 
In fact, I'm gonna cook, so follow me. Okay, so I'm not gonna be making anything super fancy today. I'm just making turkey burgers and fries because one of my weaknesses is burgers. I cannot resist a burger. So instead of cutting it off cold turkey, cutting off burgers and fries cold turkey, I'm just gonna find an alternative, which is gonna be turkey burgers and fries really, just baked potatoes, you know? <laughs> so let's begin. I'm actually gonna start with the fries because I feel like they're gonna take longer than the burgers. So let's just begin. Okay, so I'm starting with my potatoes and I'm just gonna slice them. Make sure that you start with freshly washed potatoes. Don't play yourself, okay? Don't eat dirt. Clean your potatoes, scrub them, which is what I did. And I can't really cut them with one hand while holding the camera with the other, so I'm gonna just kinda sort of. All right, now that everything's cut, I'm just gonna transfer it to a bowl. Okay, so these aren't actually all the fries. There were a lot, so they wouldn't all fit in one bowl. But I'm just gonna season them section by section. Usually I just put garlic powder, onion powder, salt, paprika, and you know, simple seasonings on here. But I ran out of seasonings. So because I ran out of seasonings today, I'm just gonna be using this adobo seasoning with pepper and also some, ooh, ooh, some salt. <laughs> Y'all, this stuff is delicious. If you never tried it, you're missing out. Not too much salt. I don't, I don't care for it to be too salty now. Make sure your hands are clean, of course. And I know it looks like I'm going light on the seasoning. It's because I am. I don't know. I like the taste of potatoes by themselves. So I'm going to go ahead and do this to the remainder of my potatoes. And I will be right back. So these are all my fries, semi-seasoned. You can barely see the seasoning. Just the way I like it. Yeah, I'm going to lay them on a baking sheet with parchment paper. So these are my little fries which is all lined up on parchment paper clearly these aren't all the fries i made i just realized that i'm gonna just store the rest and just cook these because this is gonna be enough for one or two days and that way i can keep having fresh fries so yeah so i'm just gonna pop these bad boys in the oven for 35 to 40 minutes somewhere in that range i'm just gonna keep checking them and flipping them i'm gonna flip them after like maybe 20 minutes just depending on what i'm feeling like doing so i'll show you the end result but I definitely forgot to take any pictures of the food like on a bun or while I was eating it. And I recorded it like over a week ago and I ate all of it. I, I want it to make sense, but it doesn't. Um, I'm trying more now. Like I know I'm still not doing great and I know that I still have a long way to go just to even get back to where I was in March, but I'm trying. And I just wanted to get, put out this little update to let y'all know how I was doing. Yeah, I'm getting weight, definitely gaining weight. Quarantine has not motivated me to double down. <laughs> it has not. For the people that it has motivated to do so, I'm proud of y'all, I'm happy for y'all, but for me, not the same. I'm gonna try and be more consistent with my updates on my fitness aspects of things. Thank you guys for watching. See y'all in the next one. Have a blessed one, bye. Thank you.